Well, good morning, travelers. Todd here with Traveling Around Disney. And as you can see, we have made our way back over to the Beach Club Resort because we have got to give Cape May breakfast a try. We've actually heard some really good things about Cape May breakfast, so we cannot wait to give it a try. And fellow travelers, Lori and Todd and their daughter are meeting us here for breakfast. So come along and let's see what the Beach Club and Cape May has to offer us for breakfast this morning. To give you a little layout of the land, this is the back of the Beach Club Resort right there. If you go through there, you go to the lobby and, of course, to Cape May. Coming around this way, that is Stormalong Bay back there behind the trees. That is their pirate ship slide right there. And the neat thing about Stormalong Bay is it has a sand bottom pool. Over that way is the Swan and Dolphin and, of course, the Boardwalk Resort right over there. And then this pathway right here, as I've stated in other videos, takes you straight into the back of Epcot, where you can ride the Skyliner or go into World Showcase at Epcot. Hi travelers, this is Michelle. Cape May Cafe is located within Disney's Beach Club Resort. Cape May was fashioned after a real city located in New Jersey. Cape May is a city and seaside resort at the tip of southern New Jersey's Cape May Peninsula. It's known for its grand Victorian houses, shops, restaurants, and the Cape May Lighthouse provides views across the Delaware Bay and Atlantic Ocean. This resort, including Cape May Cafe, holds a special place in the hearts of my family. We've celebrated many occasions here at Cape May. I imagine Disney's marketplace in the Beach Club Resort is fashioned after one of the many shops located on the Washington Street Mall in the city of Cape May in New Jersey. Cape May is the home of many music festivals throughout the year. This past weekend, they actually had their Exit Zero Jazz Festival. Looks like they got their robes back in. No price, but that is their robes. And of course their merchandise, the Beach Club Resort. And still one of my favorite t-shirts. Okay, when you usually go into the gift shops at most of the resorts, if not all the resorts, there's always a trivia board. But they ask you different questions, and if you can answer them all, you get a nice little prize button. Usually, that's what we do at the Contemporary. So I'm not sure what they give here, but those are their questions for today. And of course, some new DVC merchandise. Because remember, the Beach Club has a DVC section here. That's the New Year's. I have not seen this hat. The new iridescent hat for Beach Club. The frame and ornament, tumbler and mug. This is one of the new t-shirts that has come out. The button up right there, that is their new button up for Vacation Club. And then, I really love this zip pullover right here. But this is new, nothing on the back, but just the logo on the front. And this is the wishables that are out right now. And there's the Main Street, which are really hot. Of course, the 50th and the new Star Wars. And of course, since their vacation club, they've got their food and they got a cold case right over here. So they've got their cold case. And the one different thing about here, the yacht club also has it, is they have a hot section that they the food is prepared and all that and it's right literally right off of the merchandise shop so it's one in the same shop so i do like that about their shops here
cannot wait to go get our food. The buffet looks really good, and I cannot wait to try the omelet station and the crepe station. That's what I'm really looking forward to. Todd and Lori and Michelle have already made their way up to the buffet line, along with their um, Lori and Todd's daughter. And we're going to see what they have to offer us. And don't forget, they do have pog juice here, so we're going to give it a try this morning to see how it compares to all the other pog juices. Okay, so let's take a look at the breakfast buffet here at the Beach Club, which we're eating at today. Can't wait. They do have a carving station with hands and rolls right there. And then you come around to the next side. Of course, they have eggs, sausage, bacon, and potatoes. Then you continue on. Biscuits and gravy, French toast, pancakes, and Mickey waffles. Oh, he looks like he's making crepes over here. Okay, so he takes care of the crepe station, which is right here. Crepes, and then there is berry compote and whipped cream right there that you can put on those crepes. Of course, tater barrels, more pancakes, more Mickeys, and this is all the low stuff. That's why it looks so it's for the little kids. And then up here, okay, this is really starting to look good. We got some mixed vegetables, potatoes. It looks like egg Benedict, which she's getting ready to get. Green beans. And of course, with the eggs Benedict, we have the hollandaise sauce off to the side. Another station of bacon, sausage, eggs. And this is a steak and eggs right here with um, a flour tortillas. Okay, so like a breakfast burrito or breakfast taco in the morning. Then you come around here and you get grits and oatmeal and of course the fruit servings. So this buffet looks really good and I think there is a made to order omelet station. And yes, as I was correct, right where the desserts are for the dinner menus, there is a omelet station right here made to order. So that's really nice. We are sitting here enjoying our ba buffet, buffet, <laughs> our buffet, and I will have to say this food is really good. There are some selections up there that are a little different, um, especially the, the vegetable medley with the omelet is really good. Uh -huh. and the steak and I, eggs are really good. I call this an eggs benedict, but it's actually a potato, um, I guess, like a croquette and then the egg. Uh, soft oh, I didn't egg. know. That. I thought it was a biscuit. Yeah. I was waiting See, to eat it. so too. And then I got the next, the Spanish taco or Mexican taco. It's got steak and eggs that are mixed together and then the sauce and the cheese. And I got a piece of French toast with a pancake there and with the berries the and the whipped cream. And thank you, Kate May, because you use real whipped cream and not that fake stuff. So, once again, they do have pot juice, uh -huh. all you can drink, and it is fantastic. Yeah, it's so really good. This is the only, the only thing is because I do the sausage and gravy. Right. I've said it before, but this is the evaporated milk version. Good, but it's just a okay. different version than what. Okay, not the whole. Not so, the yeah, a lot of people that like sausage the half and half biscuits biscuits know okay. what I'm talking about. There's kind of two different camps. They do bring you a bread service. Still delicious. With it. And this is the bread. It's kind of like a, I would like if you made you it's can like make bread pudding cake. out of it, like a coffee cake, yeah. right? Is that what's like. Okay, so it's like a coffee cake, but of course they bring you a you vanilla demi glaze. <laughs> yeah, a vanilla on glaze. Mm -hmm. I think that's how it's pronounced. The fancy stuff, but for twenty five dollars, mm -hmm. this is a great value. Plus, there are the discounts here for like Definitely DVC, pass holder, all that good stuff. So just remember mm -hmm. that. I think I'm going to go get another omelet, which I didn't get to show you guys because I already ate it. Um, I have so much food the first round. Michelle's got I'll a never bunch eat of stuff. everything. I got. Oh, I got to get crepes. I think I they showed have a crepe it. Station. My little, a little Mickey plate. <laughs> <laughs> they got a crepe station, so I got to get some of that too. So yeah. we might it's be here a while. Like, I was expecting more of just breakfast type foods. Right. Like, before family style, they brought you the meat platter, so you have the sausage yeah, and bacon. Yeah, I agree. Eggs. But now they have other options on the buffet, which makes the buffet a buffet. Yep. Like if you don't, if you want vegetarian options, they have that. 
if you need, you know. Yeah. The kids item with the chocolate chip pancakes, and there's just such a variety of things. And Todd did mention that their pancake, I mean, their bacon is actually bacon and not the see-through bacon. We were talking about that. <laughs> Sometimes you get that thin bacon, but this is nice hearty bacon here. So very good. Enjoying our meal. Yeah, totally. it's really good. Travelers, we just got done with a fantastic breakfast here at Cape May with Lori and Todd. Thank you once again for joining us. And their daughter also joined us today, so it was fantastic. Had a great meal. I would put it up there for a breakfast buffet up there with Poma. I think it's that good. So I would definitely recommend here. What do you think? Mm -hmm. I think it's really great. I love the variety of foods that they have there, not just your typical breakfast food. So that was nice. Yeah, I, I totally good. agree with her. Um, the ready they had to lighter make things too that wasn't all quite so heavy. Right. So for your day, even if, even it was all you can eat, it's still like right. They have really some healthier foods, choices right. and stuff like that. And the omelet bar was a great addition mm -hmm. here. Had a great omelet that made really fresh good. right in front of you. The crepe bar, which so I found awesome. very different, mm -hmm. and the tacos the breakfast tacos that they had here were fantastic so all and in all the traditional yeah mickey waffles and the yeah. chocolate chip pancakes you can still get some yeah so for 25 dollars i don't think I you think can it's a great deal i would definitely come back yeah. great resort great location once again thank you todd and Lori, for joining yes, us for breakfast or letting us join you guys for breakfast since you're on your vacation we do we appreciate that vacation. yeah we invaded your vacation <laughs> but we had a great time Definitely be back here. And until next time, travelers, like we always say, travel and adventure is out there.